Yo, for the past six months, all of my content on YouTube has been primarily focusing on the finals and has also been my main game during that duration of time. But just like with every game you play the f*** out of, the time has finally come to the point where the game no longer tickles my brain and I'm just burnt out. Don't get me wrong, I love this game and think this is still one of the better FPS experiences I've had in a while, but Season 3 has failed to reignite the passion I once had for this game. And I'm pretty sure there's quite a few of you who can also relate to that. Since I'm seeing the player count has gone down quite a bit since the launch of season 3. I know I'm sounding like a negative Nancy by pointing out the player count, but don't take it the wrong way. Sure, the game is actively losing players, but every game does, and there's still a lot of people playing the finals every single day. Even though myself and others have stopped playing this game this season, the finals isn't in any danger of dying because of it. But that depends on the decisions the developers make for the future because if they continue not doing anything truly innovative with their seasons, they're going to slowly but surely start losing much more of their player base. Although season 3 is a solid season, I don't think the season was innovative or exciting. In my opinion, it's neither a step forward in the right direction or a step backward in the wrong direction. And to be honest, Season 3 didn't even take a step. Sure, there's a sick new map, a cool new battle pass, three new weapons, and some new gadgets, but that's about it. However, they did do one thing, which is the biggest change in Season 3, and that is the developers decided to make Terminal Attack the main ranked game mode, which is probably the biggest f up in human history since my birth. No, I'm just joking. But I still think it's a gigantic f up. I personally think this was a f up since what was really driving me to play this game every single day was the competitive aspect of the game. I wanted to be one of the better players on this game, but all desire for this disappeared like a fart in the wind the moment I realized Terminal Attack was the ranked game mode for this season rather than Cash Out. Obviously, there were other things that influenced my decision of finally taking a break from the game, but no ranked cash out played a significant role. I've already made a few videos about Terminal Attack and how much I'd rather watch paint dry than play this boring ass game mode, but I'm not gonna yap too much about it. But in my opinion, Terminal Attack being the ranked game mode for Season 3 has influenced a lot of players to lose interest in the game as a whole, not just me. But if I'm being honest, I can't say for certain that I'd still be interested in playing the game every day, even if the ranked mode was cash out. Although ranked cash out is gone, a normal cash out is still around, but every time I play a few games, I realize I'm not really having as much fun as I used to. The first time I ever played the finals was during its open beta, and I fell in love with the game immediately. I wish I still had the stream footage of my gameplay when I first discovered the finals, but I sh you not, I was cheesing the entire time I was playing the finals during the beta. I honestly don't even remember the last time a game has made me feel like that. The finals was fresh, and the gameplay tickled my brain until it didn't. But it took six months months of playing the game every day for me to get at the stage so I guess it's to be expected. Maybe if I had a goal of being top 500 in ranked cash out it might fuel my interest and passion enough to the point where I'm having fun again but I can't be certain since the game just hasn't been hitting my g-spot lately. g-spot as in gamer spot. No matter the game what I'm playing I find myself just not having that much fun. I could be doing really well in a game or clutch a win for my team and I don't get that rush of dopamine or serotonin like I did when I used to play this game a lot back in the day back in the day being like four months ago. And if that's happening, I think that's the telltale sign that it's about time to take a break. Anyone who is also getting burnt out in the finals, do yourself a favor and take a break. I know I'm a content creator, but you and I are in the same boat. We're not getting paid to play this game or to talk about it or to stream it. There's a ton of other games out there that we can enjoy and occupy our time and finals isn't going anywhere. This game is amazing and hopefully it will be around for years to come. Anyways, with that being said, let me know what y'all think. Am I overreacting? Or are some of you also underwhelmed with this season, which has resulted in you getting a bit burnt out on the finals? Let us converse about this like the civilized bipedal monkeys we are in the comment section down below. Also, this won't be my last video about the game, but I will be taking a break from playing this game as well as making content about it, but I'll still be posting other stuff on this channel until my love for the game gets reignited once again. Which I think it will happen since this will forever be one of the better FPS experiences that I've had in recent memory. Anyways, I've yapped long enough. I stream most Mondays and Tuesdays or whenever I do get off from work. If you want to watch me game and converse with me, feel free to slide by my stream. I will also be uploading whatever random shit pops up in my brain from now on, so keep a lookout for that. With that being said, remember
remember to stay hydrated and to stay swaggy. See ya.